uh, he said Muslims are a problem. Okay, that's what he said. Okay, are they a problem? You tell me. And I say, I don't see the people, and I use it often, that knocked down the World Trade Center going back to Sweden. Okay? So he said Muslims are a problem. That was part of what he said. Well, I mean, can you make the case that it's been tough? And by the way, most Muslims, I know many, are great people, just so you put it do on you, the record. So let's say, do you think Muslims are a problem? Well, I think a certain segment are certainly a problem, and unless you want to be so politically correct where you want me to say, oh, absolutely not. I mean, you have ISIS, you have the migration, you have all of this stuff, you have, you know, a lot of people think you're going to end up with World War III over the Middle East. I've heard that for 25 years. Mm -hmm. There's something going on when you see beheadings. I mean, beheadings, we haven't seen that since medieval times, beheadings. You see Dunkins, they call them Dunkins, drownings, where they put people in a cage, dump them in the ocean. There's something going on. Yeah. So when he said Muslims are a problem, am I supposed to say, oh, look, again, you know, you probably won't put this part. I have great friendships with many people who are Muslim, living in this mm -hmm. building, mm -hmm. okay, living here. But I have great friendships. They're phenomenal people. And most of them are like that. Have they but asked you, you about your comments? Have, what do you say to them? They, they by the you? way, they think we have a bigger problem than we do. Okay? They think we have a bigger problem because there's a radical Islamic group of people that is brutal. And unless our country gets tough and smart, and unless we have the right leadership done, we're in big trouble.